think I'm turning Japanese. I think I'm turning Japanese. I really think so. What up, jerks? Pokemon Bastard here. Here and I have a set of Matchless Fighters. It's a Japanese set. I don't know what the set is in English. Speaking of English, you can't find anything right now, so I decided to order some Japanese cards. <coughs> so yeah, I've been having a pretty hard time with my life. No, just kidding. I've been having a pretty hard time getting a hold of U.S. Pokemon cards. So I decided I would try out a different region. I'd try out some Japanese Pokemon cards. I'm gonna get a little stand for this thing. This should do nicely. Some content for another video. There we go, Matchless Fighters. I think that there's 35 packs in this one. I'm not positive, so I'm gonna count them out and we'll be right back. Okay, I was wrong. There aren't 35, there's 30, and I'm not gonna open all of these. Granted, there are less cards in each pack than there are compared to the US one, but this is still gonna be a pretty long video if I open everything. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna break it up into five boosters per video. It's gonna be a running series. What I'm gonna do is alternate between this side and that side, and I'm going to ask my stupid virtual assistant to pick a random one for me. What up, jerks? Editing ape here. I'm dumb as shit, and I keep saying the name of a specific virtual assistant as I'm recording. So anytime I say that name in the video, I'm going to bleep it out just in case anybody's listening to this without headphones. We'll start with this side. Just so I don't lose track, I'm going to put this on the side that I'm currently pulling from. Whoa! Pick a number between 1 and 15. Okay, you heard her. 7. I think it might be a little bit easier if I pull that out. I can already tell this is going to be a stupid idea. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. I'm really excited about this. I've been wanting to get into the Japanese cards for a long time. From what I've heard, they're better quality, easier to get, they're more affordable. I know there was a little bit of a drought a couple years ago, but we're facing one here, so it's not like that's unheard of. I don't believe there's any energy, and I don't know what the method is to make sure that the last one is the rare one, so I think I'm just gonna move one to the front and see what happens. One second. Okay, I don't know why, but I'm incredibly unprepared for some reason today. I like to have this little thing here to divide up the cards. Here we go. Scrafty looks like he skinned a Teletubby, but only made pants. I forget what you're called. I like that art. Look at that cherry blossom. That looks awesome. Some stupid bug. Yasmas! All right. I like that one. It's so creepy looking. Yeah. What the f***? That is weird. Kakuna always looks f***ing weird. Wait. Okay, so I, I looked through all the cards. I don't think you're guaranteed to get a rare in every pack. They're, they all either say C for common or U for uncommon. So that'll be interesting. All right, I already picked from that side. Whoa! Pick a number between 1 and 15. Okay, 1. Picking the top one on this side. Ah, fuck. So I still don't know whether it's supposed to be 1 to the front, but I'm going to keep trying that until I'm proven otherwise. Until I know exactly what it's supposed to be. I'll just look at the, the cards after the fact and see which one is the common one and where it was placed. I forget who you are, I don't care. Oh, that's pretty cool. It looks like a really fluffy, creepy cross between a Digimon and an Animal Crossing character. I like it. Diglett, very determined to get somewhere, probably up someone's butthole. Zangoose, okay. You again? So far, I gotta say, the quality of these cards is a lot nicer. They just feel better in the hand. Whoa! Pick a number between 1 and 14. Okay, 10. The packs are nicer, too. I just love the way they... Just look at that hollow to them. Not hollow, but that... I don't know what it's called. Looks like it's wrapped in quality tinfoil. One to the front, see what happens. Oh shit! <laughs> oh, that's awesome! All right, we got something good at least. That's the Galarian Articuno. Awesome, I love the way the new birds look. All right, quick break. Gonna slide that into a sleeve. Looking good, baby. All right, let's go through the rest of these, see what we ended up with. There's no point in... Shit, I don't... Oh, that was the last one. I'm pretty sure that was the last one, so it is one to the front. We'll, we'll find out for sure. Sharpedo, you. Tentacool, you're a f fool. I forget, Lantingo? Lantingle. I think it's Lantingle because it tingles people's buttholes with those little things. Okay, other side. This just feels so much nicer. I can't describe it. It's better. It's better than the English ones. The quality is much, much nicer. Whoa! Pick a number between 1 and 14. It's 11. 1. Oh, 
Lucky number 11, Kevin Levin. These do open a little nicer, I like that. One to the front. I, I miss throwing things. Seeing only the images reminds me how few of the new Pokemon I know by name. I know most of Gen 1, 2, and 4. Watch this actually be a Gen 4 Pokemon and I, and I just look like an idiot. I'm going to call this one, since it's got a heart on its nose, I'll call it Smegmaloid. I'm kind of walking glory hole. Fire Moth. Spiky Bat. Lucille! Oh, uh, Thunderous? Thunderous. I believe that's what it's called. And what is that? That's the... Oh, R for rare. Wow, even the borders just look so much better than any English pack. I don't know whether the border... I guess it's just like a regular hollow. I guess that's what it would be compared to in an English set. It just looks so much better. Alright, I'm tired of this. So I'm just gonna pick... How many have we done? We've done... Okay, we had to do some quick math. I've done four so far. This is the next one I have to pull from here. Pretty sure there were 13. Yeah, whatever. So what's a random number between 1 and 13? 2, 3, 4. One to the front. Spirit Tomb, baby! The art is great. Look at that. Oh, I think his friends might be dead. See, that's the, the rock that he comes out of. And he's got a few over here that have nothing coming out of him. Maybe he killed them. Like you? What the hell? Pull your pants up or you're gonna trip, you dumb shit. Ew. What are you doing? Is this sexual? This must be the Pokemon equivalent of using a shower head. Sick f Speaking of sick f Diglett looking for somebody's butthole to climb into. Yo, what the f We got two of the birds! Oh, that is so awesome. That is so sick. Look at that shit. Cacao! Hell yeah, birdie. As a kid, I didn't have a whole lot of respect for the legendary birds, but they've grown on me so much as I've become a mentally and emotionally stunted adult. I love it. And I'm feeling good. I'm, I want to open another one. We're opening another one. Whoa. So you've been good to me. Whoa. Pick a number between 1 and 13. Five it is. One, two... Three, four, five. Nope. Yeah, whatever. It was the fifth one. It was the fifth one. You believe me or you don't. I don't care. Come on, you f Come on. Come on. Be good. Be good to Papa. Be be. be one to the front. The backs of these cards look so much better too. Spiritomb, baby! You're back. I missed you. I'm getting a lot of duplicates. That That's kind of pissing me off, so. Uh, what are you, stupid? I don't remember your name. You're stupid. F*** off. Spike Bat, Lucille, thanks for popping in. Yeah, 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 yeah! What are you? Ew, you're so f***ing disgusting. What a gross Pokemon. It's so, it makes me sick and uncomfortable. It's a smelly looking, slimy, gross, James Bond looking sniper lizard. It's so stupid. What a dumb f***ing idea. Alright, dipwads. May as well go out on a low note. Suck my dick.